What's Kickaboo? You're watching Kickaboo Network. All questions, all the time. Next up, Between Two Burrows with Kiki and Booba. Thank you for joining us, Between Two Burrows. I'm your host, Kiki. And I'm your other host, Booba. Today, we will be talking to our friend, Terry Thompson. Hi, guys. Welcome, Terry. Thank you guys for having me. I'm so excited to be here. Hey, around here, our motto is all questions all the time. So, Miss Terry, are you ready to answer some questions? Yeah. I am always ready to answer questions. Questions are my favorite. <gasps> She's our kind of gal. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> I'm told you are the director of a steam museum. Does that mean you boil a lot of water? I do boil water for tea and for pasta, but our STEAM for the STEAM Museum stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, Arts, and Math. Ah. It's a STEAM Museum. Okay, Science, Technology, technology engineering, engineering, Arts, art, and Math. Arts and Math. math. Yes, Ooh. but you can just call it STEAM. It's so much easier. Ooh, phew. <laughs> that was starting to sweat. Okay, <laughs> well. What are some of the things that kids might see at the museum? Well, first of all, our whole museum's like a work of art. All those colorful sheets are not stained glass. They are actually dichroic. Ooh. And dichroic is a NASA 3M technology they developed to put on the astronauts' shields so it protects them in outer space. So the museum could technically go to outer space? <gasps> is your museum a rocket ship? <gasps> Actually, technically, it's not a rocket ship, but you know what joke we like to make around the museum about rocket ships in outer space? What? Tell us a love a joke. That we are all on this, this big rocket ship called Earth, and we're just mm. moving through space. Oh, I like that. I know, isn't that pretty cool? It's like every day's an adventure. Yes. Yeah. space adventure. And we're all day. astronauts. Yeah. <laughs> science. 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 So what are some of the science-y things that kids can do at the museum? Oh, yeah. there's so much science, so there's just so much to tell. But we have science exhibits all throughout the museum. We have engineering classes. Ooh. We have technology camps. We have a full-size T-Rex in the Great Hall. How'd you get it in the door? Well, it was a lot of little pieces, and we had to articulate it and put it all together in the right shape. Articulate? <laughs> Ooh, big word. What does that mean? It is a big word, but it has a little bitty meaning. It just means putting things in the right order. When scientists find these piles of bones, mm -hmm. they have to figure out which bone is connected to the next bone. Oh, oh like, like a puzzle. A, yeah, like the foot bone's connected to the arm bone. Yes, the arm bone's much. connected to the shoulder bone. Oh, so very much like that, except for uh, there's no puzzle box top. There are no oh. instructions. And sometimes scientists get it wrong. What? No. Yeah, long ago they found a pile of bones mm -hmm. and they put them all together. And then later on, scientists found another pile of bones mm -hmm. that were the same and they put it together and they realized, oh, this animal doesn't have a horn on its nose. It actually has a fifth toe. <gasps> they put a toe on <laughs> his nose. We got a toe nose sore <laughs> over like here. <laughs> he probably had a stinky nose. Oh yeah, can you imagine if you could just smell your feet all the time? <laughs> It'll pee you. That would yeah. Not be good. Ooh, no. Man, this is great. Mm -hmm. I feel like we're getting smarter already. I'm getting smarterer and smarterer. Yeah. Oh, 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 I know. But what if what if a kid can't get to one of these really cool steam museums like yours? Uh, what would they do? Yeah. Well, you know what we've done? And a lot of museums and community centers, they put STEAM lessons online so parents can look them up. And you can do things from common objects you have around the house like toothpicks and marshmallows. I have a lot of toothpicks and marshmallows. I love marshmallows. <laughs> so we get to snack. Well, first we learn and we mm -hmm. have a project so you can use these marshmallows and toothpicks oh. to make things like molecules Ooh. or bridges. Huh? And you learn what's required for certain bridges. That's engineering. <laughs> See, that's the E in steam. But I still can eat it, right? You, might get you can eat the marshmallows, but not the toothpicks. I can use the toothpicks to pick out the marshmallows in my teeth. Ooh, 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 okay. One more question. Mm -hmm. 
So it sounds like you get to work with some cool kids and some cool stuff at the STEAM Museum. Do you have a favorite story with a kid Ooh. at your museum? There's so many stories. Okay, I do have a favorite. It happened not that long ago. Um, I was about to walk up the stairs at the museum and behind me runs this three-year-old little girl up to Q, mm -hmm. one of our exhibits in the Great Hall, and she just goes, oh my goodness, that's the biggest chicken I ever did saw. <gasps> And it just, <laughs> was it a big chicken? And no, it's not a chicken. It's actually a flying reptile. Ooh. The largest known flying reptile. Wow. It was wow. pretty funny. Do you want to know his name? Oh, oh, oh yes. Okay. It starts with a Q. Can we guess? Yes. Okay, um, Quincy. Hmm. No, quite. A cutie pie. Oh, that's a good question. That's uh, a good okay. one. Okay, oh, we're getting a little closer. It's got a lot of syllables. Um, uh, I give up. Quesadilla. Oh. oh. Now you're just making me hungry. Oh, okay, okay, how about Quetzalcoatlus? Quetzalcoatlus? We weren't close at all. Uh, just, just call it Q. Okay, Q. okay, Q. okay <laughs> let's do I like that, I mm -hmm. like that. Miss Terry, wow. you are very good at all questions all the time. What are we here for? <laughs> yeah. I love answering questions, because every time someone asks a question, that's an opportunity to learn. And we love learning. Yeah. Miss Terry, thank you so much for being between two burrows. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for having me. This is a really big deal. You guys are a really big deal. This is oh, a lot stop, of fun. Stop, stop, stop it, That's Terry. all you. Stop it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> See you next time, and don't forget to ask all questions all the time. This has been Between Two Burrows with Kiki, Booba, and Terry Thompson. Wasn't that fun? <laughs> See you guys later. Bye. Man, I wonder what that big old chicken, well, non-chicken sounds like. It'll probably be like, mock, 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 mock. That's really good. That's probably exactly what it sounds like.